Hi everyone, I'm Fabio from Higher Health Project and today I'm gonna show you the new Warros Audio Melee Wall of Noise pedal. Two of the most quintessential effects that help to define the showgates genre reverb and distortion have been harnessed and woven together for an eternity of ethereal distortion with the mere wall of noise. The melee unbashedly and unapologetically use a joystick to melt reverb and distortion together into a one massive blaze of sound. For the indecisive enthusiasts, the melee can run up to three different reverb programs into distortion or with the flip of the order switch run the distortion into the reverb. But now let's focus on the pedal. The first thing that you can notice is this main joystick, of course, which works in two Ds, blending together distortion if you move it up and down or reverb if you move it right to left. Of course, you have the main volume on top left and three tiny switches for the distortion tone, the reverb decay and the placement of the reverb and the distortion position. The joystick is very sensitive, too sensitive to be used with your feet in real time. Keep in mind that this is a pedal and in my opinion, too weak to be used with your foot. Moreover, the tip material is in plastic, so in my opinion, it's not really a great idea for uh, foot operation. Maybe it could be a great idea to use the melee with a synthesizer or with a common keyboard. So putting on side the pedal from the instrument will be easily tweakable. The sustain foot switch allows you to create sustain effect in two different ways. The first way is pressing and holding basically the foot switch and whatever you will play will be kept sustained infinitely, creating a really great smooth background full of sounds. The second way is pressing the sustain switch one time and the last thing that you played before will be kept sustained 
for a very brief period of time. So what you will play after will be dry, completely dry, without the reverb, until you will press again the sustain foot switch. The three different types of reverbs can be engaged switching basically together the two main switches, so the sustain and the bypass. According to the color, you can remember the whole reverb for the purple LED, the dark with octave note in yellow LED, and lastly the reverse reverb in blue LED color. Fast distortion is really aggressive and can be used combining the reverb with the 2D uh, joystick for the solo situation or for really, really far and deep intros. Let's listen an example.
Of course, the melee is not a super easy pedal to use uh, in a song, so it can be really difficult to uh, fit in a song. But for the most creative people, this will be really fun to use and for sure a great, great tool for insane operations. So guys, this was Fabio for Higher Heads Project. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.